problems 12 and 13. The following information applies to questions 12 and 13. The pendulum consists of a small block of mass M attached to a fixed point by a string of length L. The pendulum block swings uh, down from rest from an initial angle theta max less than 90 degrees. Question 12. Which of the following statements uh, about the pendulum block's acceleration is true? Solution. First, let's uh, draw the picture. As uh, we can see from picture, Acceleration of the uh, pendulum has uh, two components. One is uh, tangential and the other is uh, centripetal. And uh, we can write expressions for these uh, accelerations. For tangential, that will be AT equal G sine theta. And for centripetal, that will be V square over L. V square we can find from energy conservation. So that's the expression for V square. And when we put V square in uh, this uh, formula for centripetal acceleration, we can get a result for centripetal acceleration. Now let's uh, estimate uh, all sentences here. A. The magnitude of the acceleration is constant for the motion. As we can see, it's not constant. It's uh, decreasing for tangential and uh, it's increasing for centripetal. And uh, if we count what is total, we have to do square root from a t square plus a c square, which is not constant either. B. The magnitude of the acceleration at the lowest point is g. The acceleration of free fall. In lowest point we have uh, tangential equal zero and the centripetal equal 2g multiplied by cosine theta which is uh, 1 minus uh, cosine theta maximum. So that's not g. C. The magnitude of the acceleration is zero at some point of the pendulum's swing. As we can see, it's not zero. A tangential has a zero in the lowest point and the centripetal zero in the highest point. But both, uh, they don't have a zero magnitude in any point. D. The acceleration is always directed toward the center of the circle, which is not true. We have tangential acceleration which is not going to the center. E. The acceleration at the bottom of the swing is uh, pointing vertically upward. That's true. Tangential equals zero and the centripetal is going vertically. So that's correct answer. Question 13. Consider the pendulum bob when it is at angle theta equal one half theta maximum on the way up, moving toward uh, theta maximum. What is the direction of the acceleration vector? Solution. Let's compare this uh, to our previous result. We had a result for tangential acceleration as a g sine theta, which is always going down and uh, left and the centripetal acceleration which is going to the center of rotation. If you look at this picture we always have a acceleration pointing to the left and to up compared to point of rotation and only for diagram D we have this result. Other pictures they are not consistent with this result. So correct answer is D.